Good morning, this is your AI host, Jay. I'm here with the automatically generated, Jernita, morning headlines on October 2, 2023. Mexico Church, 9 dead and 20 trapped after Tamaulipas roof collapse. BBC, Mexico Church roof collapses during mass, killing at least 9 killed and injuring 50. The Guardian, roof of a church collapses during a mass in northern Mexico, trapping about 30 people in the rubble. The Independent, moment Mexican church roof collapses caught on CCTV. BBC, at least 9 dead after Mexico church roof collapses during Sunday mass. Energy war, Ukraine tries to protect electricity supply before winter. The Guardian, Ben Wallace, Ukraine's counteroffensive is succeeding. Give them the tools to finish the job. The Telegraph, Ukraine fearful as West turn blind eye to more aid appeal. Never heard allies say the word victory. Hindustan Times, winter is coming to Ukraine, but Kyiv is adapting its tactics. CNN, in US fights over Ukraine aid, allies fear deeper global harm. Autumn heat continues in Europe after record-breaking September. The Guardian, European countries witnesses warmest September in human history. India today, France records hottest ever September. Anadolu Agency, English, October warm spell likely as September breaks records. BBC, September the warmest on record for Twin Cities, second wettest for Duluth. Charlotte Sainar, police search for missing girl, 9 believed abducted from New York campsite. Sky News, girl, 9, abducted from park in danger of serious harm amid frantic New York search. Daily Record, Amber Alert issued for New York girl, 9, who vanished from campsite. The Independent, dozen search for girl who disappeared camping with family upstate. The New York Times, hundreds search for US girl who disappeared while camping, cops suspect kidnap. Charity challenges Home Secretary's claims about economic migrants. Kosovan government calls on Serbia to pull all troops from border. The Guardian, NATO confirms 600 British soldiers will be deployed in Kosovo. The Telegraph, Grant Shapps uses conference speech to announce troop deployment to Poland and Kosovo. The Times and the Sunday Times, Serbia pulls some troops back from Kosovo border after warning from US. The Guardian, Vucic, Serbia does not want war with Kosovo. Opposition leader Donald Tusk cheered by crowds at Warsaw election rally. The Guardian, Donald Tusk tells hundreds of thousands at Warsaw rally change is inevitable ahead of election. The Telegraph, Poland's opposition supporters mass in Warsaw two weeks before election. Euronews, Poland's opposition hopes huge rally in Warsaw will swing election. The Guardian, Poland opposition takes to streets as hard-fought election looms. Migrants trying to reach the UK cross the Alps on foot. BBC, Desperate Journeys, The Migrant Trail Across Italy and France, BBC News. East Libya postpones Derna Reconstruction Conference amid calls for unity. The Guardian, Libya's eastern government delays Derna Reconstruction meeting. Al Monitor, Libya's eastern authorities postpone planned Derna Reconstruction Conference. Africa News, Libya's eastern government delays Derna Reconstruction meeting. The Hindu, Libya's eastern government postpones Derna Reconstruction Conference. NYC flooding, damage assessed after state of emergency declared. The Independent, New York, record rainfall causes dangerous flooding. BBC, New York flooded as city's infrastructure struggles to cope with changing climate. Sky News, flights are delayed or cancelled after New York floods. The New York Times, Nearly 30 rescues made from raging waters amid historic NY rainfall. Donald Trump set to appear at start of fraud trial as he argues his rivals are out to get him. Sky News, Donald Trump faces judge he called deranged in New York fraud case. The Times, death blow to Donald. Cohen says Trump facing biggest fear in fraud trial. MSNBC, Trump says he will be in New York court for trial on his business practices. Al Jazeera English. Trump expected to be in courtroom for first two days of civil fraud trial, sources say. Rescuers continue search for bodies at Spanish nightclubs after deadly blaze. The Guardian, Mercia, deadly nightclub fire in Spain kills at least 13 BBC News. BBC News, Spain, nightclub fire kills 13 in Mercia. BBC, Spanish nightclub fire, at least 13 dead. 
Channel 4 News, at least 13 people dead after fire at Spanish nightclub. This was all for the news. Thanks for listening. Please do not forget to like and subscribe.